Hey everyone, it's DreamSeer444 here and I want to introduce you guys to my new personal deck. It's my DreamSeer444 deck. Um, it just came in. I will be releasing it later on, maybe this month, um, for personal purchase for those of you who are tarot readers. So you guys let me know what you think about the deck. Um, I am going to do my first reading here with you guys, okay? So let's see what message do we have before the collective here. What message, Holy Spirit? Alright, so you have transformation and you have a shame. Okay, so I feel like someone is going through some type of transformation. Um... Someone could be going through the dark night of the soul at this time, and <clears throat> maybe they're dealing with uh, public shame. Some things are coming out as someone is going through a transformation. Tell me more. What's going on here with this transformation and then shame and there's Yeah, eyewitness, watching, proof. People are seeing someone transform, and... Even though this person may be going through a difficult time, um, this is a transformation that I feel is going to turn around for the good. If you are this person and you could be going through a lot or you've gone through a dark night of the soul and plenty of people may have watched you, your life on display, watched you go through so much pain and turmoil and people are surprised here at how you are going to make this make it out of this or how you have overcome it there are plenty of people that are witness to where you come from and where you um are currently at this moment tell me more about what's going on yeah and you have people around you with hidden intentions people wearing a mask um not being honest not being truthful someone has hidden intentions Okay, why is that coming up, though? Yeah, because there's a need to be cautious around certain people. There's a need for whoever you are who's gone through some type of transformation. Um, and then someone has watched you transform. I feel that people are seeing your gifts and are, are surprised about how things in your life have turned around and I feel that people may be trying to attach themselves to you for all the wrong reasons so there's a need to be cautious here because just because you have gone through your transformation or are going through a transformation doesn't mean that you need to um, open yourself up to everyone one right away and you could be a fire sign or we could be talking about a fire sign Aries Leo Sagittarius here Tell me more, please. <clears throat> okay, so the broke card came in reverse. Broke, loss of income, and lack. I feel that this is you in reverse. You're not lacking anything, and people see that your transformation has led to a great abundance, has led to great uh, reasons to celebrate. You are experience a, experiencing a great time of harvest in your life, and so... And you could possibly be going into a divine union, okay? Being divinely guided into a connection. I feel that people are watching um, how you've been blessed. And instead of people wanting to go through the transformation themselves and go through the changes to, you know, be a better person, I feel that someone has their eyes set on what you have, male or female, okay? So if you are a person who's... Um, overcome many obstacles in your life okay you've worked to go higher and higher in your walk you know your spiritual walk and just in your personal life there are certain people that envy the um the changes the transformation yes there are certain people who may have even celebrated with you at some point okay these people possibly three friends three relatives could have an issue with how well you're doing, how you have come overcome these obstacles, okay? And they and they may feel that you are turning your back on them, that you're leaving them behind, or they may have done this to you. They may have turned their back on you after celebrating with you. Yeah, this ghosted card was flipped over. 
because you may have isolated yourself to work on your healing, to improve yourself, to become a better person. And I feel like people have gotten offended or become <clears throat> ashamed because they are not growing. And some are even willing to start some type of confrontation. This gives me a vibe of someone wanting to argue with you about your personal change, about your personal beliefs, about what brought you to where you are now. You know, that some of the people who have been in your life, you may be finding out are very toxic, very karmic, you know, in nature. Yeah. And they may talk about you. They may um, have so much to say, but they're secretly watching you. At the same time, ain't that something? Because I feel like, and then and, and tarot reader came out here, so you could be a tarot reader or someone who's getting a reading or someone could be getting a reading on you, okay? Then you have new path because you are, you're on a new path in your life, okay? And like I said, you could be a spiritual guide or a tarot reader. You're in a new path in your life and you're making better choices as to what's right and what's wrong. And instead of other people being inspired by that and making changes in their own life, they choose to, to hate on you, you know? You have medical issues, health records, and doctor's visits. So <clears throat> there could be something going on with either your health or the health of those around you, or people could be saying that about you. Tell me why medical records are not here. Yeah, spiritual jail. So some, some people are facing um, some type of medical issues because of the things that they have said or spoken again. Yeah, look, gossip, rumors. So this could be someone spreading rumors about you, about your your health or whatever. Or this could be people around you who have spread gossip that are now finding themselves in spiritual jail and dealing with all type of health issues because they're speaking against someone who hasn't even done anything to them. So you see people around you and things are, are happening to, to them. You know, sometimes... Look, they might even come to you for healing, temporary relief, but they, they're going to cover the real issue. The real issue is they have an issue with their heart. They have an issue in their heart because of the fact that they are, are really hating on someone who's never done anything to them. The only thing you did was transform your life. You worked on you. You worked on becoming a better person. So how does that hurt anyone what you're doing for yourself. This is your personal journey. And I tell people this, that this is a personal journey. If we're friends, we're friends. My choice, my decisions are my choices and my decisions. I'm going to respect yours and I will hope that you will respect mine. But <clears throat> this is a clear you know, evidence right here of how people can switch up on you and change when you decide to do something better and step out on faith and and make moves that some people would not would not dare to make so i would say to you whoever you are continue to do the work that you're doing if you are a tarot reader or you're thinking about becoming a tarot reader or you're just someone who brings love and encouragement and in life and into the lives of others continue to do the work because there are more people needed just like you all right so this is what i have for you guys um, tell me how you like the cards. I am working on them. I do have to tweak them a little bit before they actually come out um, into the public, but they will be on different um, in different stores. Um, so I'll see you guys on the next one.